Hello, welcome back. In this episode I'm going to be showing you the mining laser and I'm going to be showing you how to effectively use it to make yourself very, very wealthy. So let's get to it. So let's make the mining laser. So to make the mining laser you're going to need to make yourself two energy crystals. Um, you don't have to charge these up before but you can do if you want to, it doesn't make any difference. It just means if you put charged energy crystals into it you end up with it charged initially. You don't have to charge it, so it doesn't really make any difference. Um, so you need two of those. So the energy crystals, again, are just a diamond surrounded by redstone. And then you need to make four mixed metal ingots. So remember that you get two for each each recipe that you make. So is that the right way around? Yes, it is. It's a miracle. Excellent. Okay, so we'll just pop those in the compressor. Uh, just turn it off. You're also going to need an advanced circuit, so we have to start by making a normal circuit. Tedious. Tedious. There we go. <laughs> uh, and then turn that into an advanced circuit. So, uh, lapis either side, left and right. And then the glowstone underneath and on top and then redstone in all the corners. There we go, advanced circuit. So I'll just check on the advanced alloy, see where we are. Okay, so we've got all the parts that we need now. So advanced alloy goes here, 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 and here. Uh, one redstone at the end, one circuit just here, and then your two energy crystals there and there. And there is the mining laser. So I'll just pop this one into charge quickly, and uh, then we'll go mining. So I'm ready to go now. All the armor's charged. I've got my jetpack. I've got my miner's backpack as well. Um, I've got some food. Got my nano saber. Got the mining laser. Got a diamond pickaxe for any precious items because it's worth noting that the mining laser can actually just destroy blocks sometimes. Um, but it is good for just speed mining and finding stuff quickly. Um, and of course some torches. Don't leave home without them. So I've just wandered out a bit from my home. And uh, I'd say that this place looks as good as any. Uh, so all we need to do is hold down M and right click. And we can change the modes of the mining laser. Now you've got low focus, long range, horizontal, scatter, explosive, mining. So we're going to stick to low focus for now, because all we want to do is just dig a hole. So we're going to go all the way down to the bedrock. All the way down. Shouldn't take too long with this. Oh! Oh, I'm in a cave. Okay, well that worked. Right, so immediately we got gems, so we'll just make our way to them. I'm pretty sure with this armour I can jump in the lava. Yeah, doesn't actually hurt. Brilliant. Okay, um, so you could just shoot these, but I'm just going to pick them out quickly. Okay, so we're going to go through this wall. And we're going to open it up. So uh, this might cause a bit of lag. We'll see what happens. Uh, so we're going to do the scatter. Kaboom! There we go, so there's a few bits in here. A bit of lava there that kind of stopped, uh, stopped the shot going as far as I'd hoped. So we're just going to shoot again. Yeah, it's going to burn most of the stuff, so that's not brilliant. We'll go this way. So just go around and clean up. Have some of that iron as well. Have some of the nickelite up here. So yeah, as you can see, if you do this, you just tunnel into well, all sorts. Let's see. I'm going to see if I find some diamonds. So, scatter. Scatter again. <laughs> it is raining from the roof. Pop a torch down so we can see what we're doing. Okay, so it's quite a bit down here. Mostly cobble, to be honest. Which you can always ditch. It's not a huge problem. Oh, uranium. Love that. We're going to need that in a few episodes' time, I think. Have that. Okay. So this is basically all there is to it, and you can just mine away, and you can just take out all the richest bits. You can just dig in a straight line if you want. Just hold it down and just get the angle right. And then every time you come across something, 
just like you would do normally with a pickaxe if you were sort of tunnelling but much much quicker redstone, oh light show let's put another torch down ok so we'll we'll just try something different, I'll just get that redstone how are we doing for resources? so yeah there's quite a bit in there but uh, we haven't found much much that's expensive and exciting <coughs> no that didn't seem to work, just knocked me back come on so that's on explosive mode there we go a bit of gold in there, bit of mud and we'll just blow the ceiling out uses a lot of power using it like that and to be honest don't get a huge amount of ore <laughs> so we'll go back to low focus oh shit <laughs> That is one of the inherent dangers with blowing out massive caves. Okay, right. I'll, the fire will go out. It's fine. <laughs> there we go. Bit of gold. Ah, don't fall in the lava, I'll have you. Okay. More gold. Yes, that's what I need. Oh shit, I'm right under some lava. <laughs> Well, I suppose I could always try swimming through it. It just depends how far it goes. Okay. That's a bit weird. Get me out. Okay, so I seem to have dug up into uh, another cave. Just go. More gems. We'll have those. Oh, water. <laughs> Well, there you go. My luck was in on that one. Still no diamonds as yet. Bit disappointing. So a bit more of that. Oh, the mining lasers are getting a bit low. But I mean, as you can see from this technique, I found a lot of gold. You can really unearth a lot of stuff. More lava there, more nickelite, more redstone. I always need a redstone these days. Have all of it. Whoa! <laughs> Cave collapse. God, give me a couple. Nope. This will just come down around me. See, that's the sort of stuff that would probably kill you usually. But with the, uh, the nano armor on, it's all just fine. Get that nickelite. Useless, but worth a lot. Okay, I'm just going to blow a hole here again. We'll go for the scatter. Okay, lava's going to come down. So I'll gather what I can and get out of the way. Ah, <laughs> oh, missed some redstone, I think. Let's get this way. Uh, just got one more blast. Whoa! I <laughs> fired it through the lava. Okay. Um, so when your mining laser reaches about this level, sort of... Uh, I don't know, about a fifth left. It's time to leave, really. Because otherwise you've got to try and navigate out of the strange caves that you've dug yourself. Just get these last few bits that are around here. Okay, so. To leave the cave, what we do is we make sure it's set to low focus. Put the jetpack on. God, there's just cobble everywhere. <laughs> there's tons of it and then just shoot and head up and we just go all the way back up and hopefully the mining laser won't run out so uh, now it's got plenty left in it god we're low in the ground, there we are straight out and there's my home so there you go that is one of the techniques and I will show you another one in just a mo so I've got all my kit together again so now we're going to head into the never. So let's go. Okay, so as before when we came here, we're after the glowstone again because it's worth an absolute fortune when we uh, use it as EMC. So let's just pop the old jetpack on. Now while, you, while you've got the jetpack on, you are fairly vulnerable. You definitely don't want to be falling in the lava. So... Oh, 
Oh, you will observe as well that I haven't actually followed my, my never rules when I bring obsidian and stuff with me. So let's can't even get up. Let's find some glowstone. Now we need to find glowstone that is um, not over lava. One of the issues with this jetpack that noticed is this is as high as I can get with it. And this is to do with the elevation that I'm actually at. So um, there are other jetpacks that we can make, so we may well make some different ones in the future. Uh, just to help us, especially with being in the never. It is tricky to get to it sometimes, but we've got the mining laser, so we've got a bit of range. Um, just going to take some of this. and use it to block the lava. Before I do that, just in case, safety first. So with this patch of glowstone, I'm just going to set it to mining. And just take a few shots at it and just bring it all down. And there you go. <laughs> Rich. So we've got another patch of glowstone here, so I'm just going to switch it to explosive. And we're going to use that on this bit. Just try and hook it right in the middle there. There we go. Kaboom. Not a huge amount of glowstone, as I've said before with the uh, explosive variant of it. Oh, get away from me, Kay. Another bit here. So, oh, we've got some zombie pigmen. Yeah, we'll fight them. Do we still get pork? I'm not entirely sure. Let's find out. Oh, mate. Die, 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 you can't hurt me. Oh, they've got loads of gold on them. Okay, so uh, maybe the mining technique should just be to mine the pigmen. <laughs> That's almost better than the last trip that I did. Okay, we'll um, just bring a bit more of this down and then uh, we'll head back. Got another pigman down here. Just drop in on him. Oh. <laughs> oh, it's full of stuff. <laughs> Glistening melon. Wow. So, while I'm here, and I've got all my stuff on me, I think it's worth checking out this uh, Never Stronghold that I found before. So let's go and have a look around here and see what we can find. There might be some bounty. Oh, more pigmen. Don't mind if I do. Let's have them. Yeah, they just come to you, it's brilliant. Golden nuggets on him. More golden nuggets on him. No, he, had, he didn't have a thing! This guy looks like he's got a bit of money on him. Come on. Oh yes. Look at the gold! Brilliant. Let's have a look, see if it leads anywhere. Well, that was almost completely pointless. But uh, never mind. Picked up a few bits. A uh, bit of never wart. Mm. Yeah, great. Okay, so we'll head back. So that's it for this video, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Hopefully you'll find your new equipment and those techniques useful in your mining, and you'll be able to make a fine profit out of them. I'll see you next time. Cheers!